Leaving the United States and its familiar surroundings, Jeff and son Joshua head on a mission trip to Panama to an unfamiliar culture and climate to answer the call of Jesus. To go and make disciples of all nations. Baptizing them in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Teaching them to observe all that I commanded you. And he will be with us, even to the end of the earth. And this is the zone where the Kuna tribes live, all along the lake. So now what we're going to do is we're going to jump in the boat and we're gonna go and search for the community called Pintufo, where we have a pastor waiting for us to be trained. And here in Pintufo, you can't go outside the pastor's house and go do explore any place without first going to see the Sila and paying a tax. And once you pay the tax to the Sila, then you have the freedom to go and visit and get to know the people. Pintupo is a small village of 400 on a lake in the southeastern jungle of Panama. Pintupo is one of several small villages where the Kuna Indians live. The Kuna Indians are an unreached people group living on a reservation separated from the main population in Panama. We're going to meet up with Pastor Raul. I met last year, uh, ready for us to um, be with him and be able to encourage him and also just give him some material that help him. Come missionaries in the nearby villages that have no ongoing missionary work. Our goal is to have a house church raised up in each of the Kuna villages. The young men in the village love playing soccer most days after work. <laughs> they make awesome huts made of palm trees with grass thatched roofs. We were able to build relationships with them by helping them tear down an old thatched roof and haul off the materials to be burned. In the jungle, the team adapted ways to bathe and do laundry. You clean your clothes and you clean your body at the same time. <laughs> to eat, we netted fish. Bien, bien, bien. To sleep, we slept on hammocks. The women make beautiful clothing and hand-sewn artwork. We were able to teach them how to evangelize using their testimony to share the gospel. And we even have some youth that are interested and have started training to become missionaries in villages close by here. Adios, Our hope is to return Adios. to Bintupo and the surrounding villages with a medical team to do a clinic with the goal of helping the people and encouraging the growth of the churches. Adios. If you would like to go with us or help someone to go, please contact us.